Officers all over the country and here in the tri-state are dealing with some very difficult emotions in the wake of the violence in Dallas. Local 12's Larry Davis spent the day with Hamilton officers to find out how they're dealing with the impact of what happened. I tell you, I had a hard time sleeping last night. Hamilton police officer Eric Taylor was shocked and saddened as he watched coverage of the shootings of police officers in Dallas. Some questions quickly came to mind. What's the end game here? What, what are, what's society turning into? You know what I mean? Taylor, a Hispanic American, is a 17 year veteran of the Hamilton Police Department. He has spent a lot of time patrolling and walking the streets of Hamilton's diverse neighborhoods. Today, the shootings in Dallas were top of mind in the HPD patrol room. It's, it's terrible. I mean, I can't imagine what their families are going through. I know that it rattled mine. Yeah. Yeah, me too. Uh, my, all my three daughters uh, hugged me, jumped in, in the bed and said, Dad, don't go to work today. Yeah. The Hamilton Police Department is located in the city's second ward, a neighborhood of whites, blacks, and Hispanics. And that's why when it comes to recruiting new officers, diversity is key. First year police officer Montez Lee says what happened last night in Dallas and elsewhere has not deterred him in his dream to be a police officer. He wants to make a difference. I want to influence, influence people's lives every day. Every, um, it's just little things, little things that makes me smile. If I can have somebody, if, if I can just help somebody, whether it's giving them directions or something like that, still, it, it makes me smile. It, it makes me feel better and it gives me a purpose. In the wake of last night's shootings in Dallas, Officer Eric Taylor realizes that fellow officers are both angry and scared. Being scared makes you more aware and, and makes you more uh, uh, aware of uh, and, and to pay attention, to do your job better. Even though the shootings happened hundreds of miles away, the killings of police officers have impacted police departments everywhere. So it is a tough day. and. Um... I'm not sure it'll be the last update that we have, but um, we're going to get through this. In Hamilton, Larry Davis, Local 12 News. And our coverage of the ambush in Dallas continues. Coming up, local leaders talk about security with a rally that's planned for Cincinnati this weekend.